People yesterday in Mayfield and in Graves County, Kentucky had fantastic weather for that event and we're tracking sunny skies for the rest of the afternoon and temperatures are going to be running well above average for today. Although we are tracking a cold front that's going to have slightly below. It's going to bring us slightly above average temperatures for tomorrow, but above average temperatures are going to be returning as we get into the latter half of the work week. There's that cold front off towards our north and it is starting to track through our region and that center of high pressure is over portions of North and South Carolina, and that is what is is giving us all of this calm weather. There's that cold front a little bit closer. You can see that there are a few clouds behind it, and we are expecting a few clouds to roll through our region late tonight and into tomorrow, but overall we should be remaining dry with this front. You're taking a live look into portions of Carbondale where we are not seeing a single cloud in the sky, which is very nice. The sun is shining out there this midday and our temperatures are already pretty warm as of about 11 o'clock this morning. We're seeing things at 51 in Carbondale, 51 in Harrisburg and 51 as well in Carmi. It's a little bit warmer in Murray at 52 degrees and a little bit cooler in Poplar Bluff at 47 degrees. And it's about 10 to 11 degrees and maybe even as much as 12 degrees warmer than where it was 24 hours ago. So things are warming. Winds are also pretty calm this midday with two mile per hour wind gusts being observed in Harrisburg, five mile per hour wind gusts being observed around Carbondale and seven miles per hour wind gusts being observed around Murray. As we go throughout the rest of the afternoon, we're going to see temperatures at 12 be around 51, 54 by the time we make it to 2 o'clock, and then by the time we make it to 4 o'clock this afternoon, we're going to be seeing a temperature of about 52 degrees. Here's that cold front by 1 o'clock this afternoon. It's going to continue to track further towards the south by 6 o'clock, and you'll notice that we are going to see a few more clouds work their way into the region, and by midnight, I'm expecting us to be overcast to completely cloudy, and by the time we wake up tomorrow, I'm expecting us to wake up to over overcast skies. However, those clouds will start to work their way out of here by the time we make it to about two or three o'clock tomorrow afternoon. So we will be seeing partly cloudy skies and a little bit of sunshine into the afternoon. Those clouds are going to sort of act like a blanket for some of us tomorrow morning, and we're only going to see morning lows into the upper 20s and lower 30s and maybe even a few mid 30s down into portions of southeastern Missouri and northern Tennessee. Highs tomorrow across southern Illinois are going to be running pretty close to average with temperatures being at about 46 to 47 degrees in southeastern or in southern Illinois. Southeastern Missouri looks to be pretty similar in terms of temperatures, although we may make it to the upper 40s further back towards the south and towards the west. And portions of western Kentucky look to be pretty similar as well, although portions of northern Tennessee may make it into the lower 50s. And as we go throughout the rest of the afternoon and overnight hours, wind gusts are going to be fairly calm and that's really going to help us tomorrow morning as I'm not anticipating any kind of intense wind chill tomorrow morning. We're really going to be running above average over the next couple of days. It, it looks like Wednesday is so far is going to be our coldest day and then we'll be returning right back into the low to mid 50s by Thursday and Friday and we're really going to be remaining dry this week. I'm not expecting any sort of rain chance until Saturday where we could see a few stray showers, but overall we're going to be remaining dry through Sunday and Monday as well. So keep that storm track three app handy, although things are looking to be pretty calm and pretty above average for the remainder of the work week. So just to recap, we're going to be seeing a high today of about 54 degrees, 48 tomorrow. And by the time we make it to Wednesday and Thursday, we're going to be back into the low to mid 50s and mid 50s for the weekend. By the time we make it into again the weekend.